Vamdala wa kambuji na GBM. What I said yesterday. What I said yesterday. You know very well that I was right. You know that I was right. That's why you can't respond. Now you are sending these bulldogs around you to be calling me and intimidating me. That is below what we expect of politics nowadays. Especially when you are trying to say that you want to uh, you want to lead PF. PF which is rebranding. And then I'm having cadres calling me, insulting me, insulting Edgar Lungu. I mean, you are not worth the modern PF, the PF that uh, people want to build. You are not worth it. You are not worth it by the very fact that I am receiving, I'm receiving phone calls, insulting me, threatening me from your cadres, Wakambuiri. Wakambuiri, it clearly shows that you are not worth to be PF president. You are not worth it. Because what brought down PF, apart from your usual ranting, uh, you know, um, uh, allegations on corruption on PF and Edgar Lungu, the other thing that brought down PF was Kadarism. But Imovakamwidi, you have continued with this Kada mentality. You always try to play it like, no, you are not part of it and whatever, whatever, but come on. Why is it that uh, Mundubile doesn't have Kadas? Eh? Why is it that Mundubile doesn't have Kadas? Why is it that Kafua doesn't have Kadas? Why is it that Emmanuel Mamba doesn't have Kadas? Why is it that Imovakamwidi? You are the one who is surrounded by these cadres who have no fear or who have disregard for other people's rights and they can call at any time and start insulting us. It is because that is your character. That is your character. So me, those people who are calling me, I'm putting it on you, Wakamwini. It is you insulting me. It's you insulting Edgar Lungu. It's you threatening me. You can't run away from it. Because why is it that only you, only you, Wakambwili, you are the one with cadres? Pamupini na Antoineken, pamupini na na Maos, eh? Maos na wewe fido chita fidia, you know, fido chita hiring thugs, giving them money, you know, to attack people. It is not good. It is not good. Some of these things that you do, you are disregarding the law, and one day the law will catch up with you. The law will catch up with you. What I said yesterday, for me, I just say things as the way they, as, as they are. That's all. What I said yesterday, it's nothing but the truth. GBM, you contributed heavily to bring down PF. You were hell bent to bring down PF. And what you did to PF, PF never recovered. PF never recovered. You launched a serious attack from the time that you launched serious attack in 2014 when you were Satawa When you launched attack by GBM Mwata and Pidepo, you launched a serious attack on PF. Bakamburinaimumaisa on serious attack on PF. PF has never been the same. PF has never recovered until it even lost the elections. And this is the truth. Now I tell you the truth. And now you start unleashing cadres on me. I mean, I'm not interested in start recording people and throwing on social media, but otherwise, I would, today I would have been releasing insults on social media, but I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. And those people, for me, I'm not blaming those who are calling me. I'm blaming you. Welcome within our GBM. It's you sending those people. Those people, they are insulting me because, you know, they want to please you. They want to please you. They want to get something from you. That's why they are insulting me. That's why they are insulting Edgar Lungu. And I don't understand why you keep dragging Edgar Lungu in, in whatever. Edgar Lungu doesn't give me money. Edgar Lungu doesn't give me money to, for me to, to talk about Wakambwiri, for me to do, forget it. He doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't. And my interaction with Edgar Lungu is not like he, these others who interact with him on a daily basis. For me, I interact with him only when there is something that I need to discuss with him. That's all. Only when I need to clarify something. That's when I interact with him. 
Edgar Lungu doesn't command me, doesn't tell me, go and do this, go and do this, nothing. And as far as I know, Edgar Lungu is not even playing any machination in PF. The last time I met him, I was actually asking by Edgar Lungu to say, look, things are messing up in PF, you need to step up. You need to step in. I, that's what I went to, it's me. And I'm telling you, he was refusing. I was telling him to say, look, because, you know, people are saying, no, PFA doesn't have, doesn't have uh, leadership. And yet you are here. Why don't you come in? And he says, no, I've left people there. They are supposed to sort out all this. I said, no, you are the person that is elected. This is the agenda. This is what I was talking with by Edgar Lungu when I was last there. Now, and yet, when you are talking on social media, you talk like it's him who come up with this thing to say, no, I want to come back. No, I want to do this. Edgar Lungu is refusing. And to be honest with you, I told you, Edgar Lungu, to say, you sitting back at home like this, you are making it difficult for PF, you know, to rebrand itself and to go up. You need to come in and help with the leadership. That is, that is the point. And he, up to today, you haven't seen, because really, if he took my advice and if he really is excited, today Edgar Lungu would, be, would have said, no, I'm, go, I'm back as president. Edgar Lungu is not interested in politics in the manner that you are trying to talk about this. You are so paranoid about Edgar Lungu. Innocent activities. If you want to register for you are putting it on Edgar Lungu. Edgar Lungu is he has taken it easy on politics. Even when we are pushing him to say, come up. And I've seen some people are saying, no, Edgar Lungu resigned. Where did he resign? Where did he resign? Because if he resigned, that letter should have been with the Central Committee. Where do you resign? Eh? If you are working for a company, you are working for a company, where do you resign? Do you go and resign to another company? Can Edgar Lungu go and resign to UPND? If he is a, is a, is a member of a PF, he has to resign to PF. And I want to challenge you because you want to mislead people that know Edgar Lungu resigned. Show us the letter where Edgar Lungu wrote a letter to say, I have resigned as president of PF and he, as a member of PF. Show us. Show us where he resigned. You are misleading people. You are calling me, hey, Edgar Lungu Alixta resigned. Edgar Lungu Alixta resigned. Where did he resign? Show us the letter where Edgar Lungu resigned. Let us be sincere. Let us be sincere. Let us not lie against people. In me, I don't lie against people. I don't run propaganda. I don't. Me, I speak about things that I know. And even when I'm mentioning uh, Edgar Lungu, I would not mention Edgar Lungu. If at all, I have not spoken to him. If at all, I have not heard his word. And his word is that, look, I am not interested in politics as at now. I want, I've done my part and I want to push other people to come up. That is his view. That is his view. So in Shishiboko left me a hallucination, he applied the time of Edgar Lungu, Edgar Lungu, Edgar Lungu. Spare the man. Yes, he's still president of PF. And he doesn't need whatever, whatever. He can come back at any time. He retired. Where did he retire? You Patrick Warrior. Where did Edgar Lungu retire? Where did he retire? He hasn't retired. The man... I mean, just he has just subtracted himself. He's there, resting. But if need be, he will come up. If need be, Edgar Lungu will come up. This is a fact. If there is a need, Edgar Lungu will come back. Whether he likes it or not, because we will go and camp at his house and bring him out because he's the president. He owes PF that obligation. Edgar Lungu owes PF that obligation to lead PF when things really reach that level where we cannot handle it. And you are saying, hey, what about the party? Why are you interested in talking about in talking about um, PF? I've told you, PF, me, the Economic and Equity Party is a necessary. It's a necessary for PF. It's a necessary for PF. So I am growing. I'm still growing. I need PF for my, for my, uh, 
political uh, sustenance. I need PF. I need PF. Ngabanjikata, who comes? Eh? You think Makebi comes because of what? Makebi comes because I'm attached to PF. Jonas Zimba comes because I'm attached to PF. Somewhere, somehow. And I need that support. I need it. So, wupuwa wukopo. Ukulalan that, no. Eh, eh, why are you talking about PF? I am, I, am, I am a stakeholder in PF. And you will not stop it. Whether you like it or not, PF, I am a stakeholder. I'm also a stakeholder. I'm not afraid of me. Socialist party is another party that, you know, I like. And I'm afraid of me. I like him also. So I'm also a stakeholder, even in socialist. If what is happening in PF is happening in socialist, I will come here and I will talk about it. So therefore, I'm wishing even socialist is part of you know the party. Me, there are parties that I've identified where I am close, where I've got an a working arrangement. I've got I've got a working arrangement with my PF. I've got a working arrangement with the uh, EFF. Eh, Kason de Mwenda. I've got an a, 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 a working relationship with the GOP. A, a Jackson Silavwe. I've got a working relationship with the Socialist Party. I've got a rela working relationship with Heritage Party. Eh? Um, I've got a relationship even with NDC. The subsidiary here eh? the, 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 the political lifeboat here in Political lifeboat here in Kambuidi ni ni NDC. But as far as I'm concerned, Savoy is running that party, and I've got a relationship with Savoy with that with that with that party. So there is no one who no no. You have got your party. Stay in your party. Forget it. Political parties are public. Political parties anyone can can have a local standard in that party. You don't necessarily have to be a member. That's why you submit a constitution to the registrar of societies. So forget it. Like any upuba. Uh, if you letter and whatever, whatever, and you should know, I'm not one person that you should intimidate. So if you are going to come here and start intimidating me, phoning me, hey, hey, Vachemeni, I want to win. Vachemeni, vachemeni. Control your people. But I'm telling you, this kind of politics, Vakambuidi, it is not the kind of politics that we want at this time, at this, at this age. We don't want this kind of politics. Politics, I'm Politics, I'm a Ah, he finish. That's why Konsefe Komwana, I'm a cadder. Konsefe Komwana, I'm a Finish. Finish, Mutina. You are the cowards, actually. You are the cowards and you hide in these in these cadres, Ishimimburu Shenishi, these bulldogs around you. That's where you hide. Because you are cowards. You are failing to talk. If you want, if you are not happy with what I say, why don't you call me yourself? So that is that is a that is that and now so if you padiba 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 mdalawa bakambuidi and surely from my point of view bakambuidi na ba GBM even mouse but you should have just stayed stayed aside you should have just stayed aside because really I mean, it's immoral for you to even wanting to, to want to lead PF at this point in time. After what you did to PF, Kmao Sampa, you left. Ba GBM, you left. Ba Kambiri, you left. And today you want to come back and you want to lead PF. Just go back and pick up your 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 political parties if you want. Eh? Because some of you are thinking that Bali were popular. Hey, Ba Kambiri, Bali were popular. Hey, Ba GBM, Bali were popular. Imwe, you are the aged, you are political aged people. You need to be in, in, in at daycare, not, not daycare, better channel. Muma eh? hospice. Imwe, your political life is in the hospice now. He is in the hospice. 
There are young people that are coming up. Avena kason de mwenda. These people are coming up. Imwe ulubumbiru enu na lupwa. Na lupwa. So, ichi indike nifye. So that na imwe tumichi indike. But inga mwambo kula takiri kitikiri kitikiri kitikiri. Tua mwambo kula tinta nefifini. Mwambo. Eh? Imwe mulibapa ukuma hospice. Home of the aged. That's where you are. That's where you belong. That's where you belong. That's why Edgar Lungu is very good. Edgar Lungu is good. That's why Edgar Lungu is not coming up. He's not fighting and whatever, whatever. Because he has considered himself to say, Ina nari kula no. Eh? Same, same with the uh, uh, given winner. Given winner, man, I didn't stay impressed the way he, he, he was talking. You know. But he went, pirikiti, pirikiti, me nafa ture tintana, tintana. He went, na mukula ba GBM. Ah, he. Ishta ya nuya di pwa. He? Oko mwadi kuli waka undi oko. Mwadi ba GBM, undi waka undi. Eh? Come on, when are you going to stop? Eh? When are you going to stop? Just sit back, we will look after you. 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 Namukula. Chirishan kanshi. Ala? Fish. Ah.